I believe that this act of selling sex for money has always been there. This is not the first time. I've said that one of the oldest professions you can ever get is prostitution. So if we are bold enough to have Moesha Budon coming to say it boldly, that everything she owns, where she lives, the car she drives, is as a result of the act of prostitution. I don't know why people have become hypocritical about this and they are saying other things about it. Moesha Budon has come out to say she's a prostitute and she's making money out of prostitution. Fine, fair enough. What are the moral lessons? It doesn't make sense that you raise a daughter like Moesha and all she can do with her life to live is prostitution. It tells you the home she's coming from has a question mark. Was she raised like this? Is this something that has come as part of her natural life and instincts? Or it is because of the order of the day? Is it that she's living above her means? Or she has refused to be what she's supposed to do? Ladies and gentlemen, my issue is very, very simple. Moesha Bidon's issue coming up every time to come and make it an open statement that she is enjoying what she's enjoying through prostitution and people are saying she didn't speak well let's give the first reaction to ourselves that if moesha budon is practicing prostitution is it normal she's not the first to do it like you keep saying but she has friends who are equally doing the same thing who have not spoken so if you're a headmaster of a school you have a guy named Baudet, whatever however your name would not be mentioned until there's a speech and prize giving day. Moshe Budu and their friends who are making money and making headways in this country are practicing prostitution. Ashawo, Ashawo, Ashawo is what the girls are doing in this country. And they are making big names, driving big cars. When they are driving in town, the sound of their cars is shouting Ashawo, 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 Ashawo. But they are driving it. They go to their room, they open their door, Ashawo Shina.